I don't cook. I'm the food god. I eat out 365 days a year. So, dude, what do you got? What do you got for the food god? What's up guys, it's Food God and I'm here at Cosmo playing the expensive taste test. The rules are really simple. They're gonna put two objects in front of me and I, as the Food God, have to choose which one is more expensive. You know what? I know they're gonna try to trick me, so I don't know how I'm gonna do, cause my palate is pretty good, but I know they like to play games. They're gonna throw the extra chunks so it feels more expensive, the extra bubbles. I don't know, but I wanna play. I am so ready, let's go. How different of a price can mac and cheese be though? That's what I don't understand. It's either $3.99 or $4.50. This looks like Velveeta, I tell ya. Noodles are real cheap on this one. This has to be Velveeta. I guess nothing could be this creamy and expensive. Oh, it's watery cheap. I don't care. There's no way I can be wrong. No way. Mm -mm. That kind of box cheese. All right, let's try this. It's stiffed up. It's a nice white color. White cheese is usually not cheap, so the yellow has to be cheaper. I mean, this is a solid plate. I don't know how it could be wrong. This has to be the more expensive one. This has to be Velveeta. I don't know. Guys, thank God. Here we go. Next. No, I'm not eating crickets. We're not, I, I'll smell them, but I gotta tell you the ones that, I'm not trying crickets. I'm not, my immune system needs to be solid. smell exactly the same, these little suckers. See, these are all different shapes and stuff, which means leads me to believe that they're cheaper because there's a lot of different shapes, so there's no consistency. This looks like a nice grown farm of crickets made to eat. I'm gonna not even try it, and I'm gonna just say this one's more expensive. Thank you. Let's move it on. This is what, goat cheese? I mean, uh, what is this? I can't see with my glasses on. This one has to be more expensive. I don't know, I haven't tried it, but it, I feel like this one looks like a real cheap piece of cheese. This one tastes better because it's smoother, but I don't know why I want to say this one's more expensive. Because this looks like just a little bit better of quality. It doesn't taste better, it just feels better. This one feels too predictable. I could be wrong, I'm just gonna say this one's more expensive. It is, okay, that's what I thought, okay. I'm definitely thirsty. What do you got? What do you got for the food god? Is it water? No way to tell with a straw. Do you remember which is which? You sure? This has to be the tap. I think this is the tap water. This is the bottled water. I'm right, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, this one smells better. The one with a little bit more on it, the deeper yellow, smells a little bit much more like rich olive oil. I'm gonna try that one first to see. But you never know with olive oil, sometimes it's fake. This has to be the real one. I'm gonna just not even try the other one. It's just rich. Just tastes rich. I mean, I'll try the other one for fun, but if this is, the, if this is a fake, if this is the bad one, then they did a really good job. This one's pretty rich too. Tastes a little chemically though. But it's got a bite. This is tough. This one's very light. I do not think that this is, but it's actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be wrong. I've been so good. I don't cook. I'm the food guy. I eat out 365 days a year. So with olive oil, I mean, ugh, this one's really bad. I'm going to change my mind and I'm going to go with this one. I don't know. It feels a little bit. Wow. Thank God I tasted it. It looked really light, I gotta tell you, I but when, it. I, That's why we when I tasted pizza. it, I was like, wait, this feels much more, like it's so strong, but it's so light. Unbelievable. Wow. I knew it, I knew it! I'm so happy I tried it. It was my mistake for not trying. I'm, I can't stand green olives. I hate green olives. I like black oh. column. Give me something else. Please, I'll, you know, I'll do a little, but look, go ahead. Let's see something else. Green, I like Kalamata olives. I like good dark olives. Dark olives too. All right, this is, oh God. Okay, well, they're both out of a bag. I could tell the mush. 
This one's better than this one, but it's been sitting around. So this has to be the real one because this, this has to be out of a bag. I mean, it's literally like a baseball. Look at this mush. I mean, literally, this is garbage. This has to be the more expensive one. <laughs> Thank God. Tomato juice. Well, one's watery, one's thicker, but I'm not gonna play that game because of that oil. I can't believe there's expensive enough. This is very watery. So they both taste like tomato juice, but this one, I mean, look at the beautiful tomato right here on the side. I mean, you just see the tomato kernels. I don't know what's more expensive for tomato, what qualifies it as being more expensive. That's the problem. I would think the one with the more tomato kind of thicker, real chunks. It's definitely sour though. It has to be this one. It has to be. It is, right? Okay, this just feels so cheap. Not bad, I'm allowed one mess up. Where is it? Where's the one that's gonna mess me up? Oh, well it was mochi ice cream. <laughs> now it's a little, what flavor is this? Chocolate. Both chocolate? Yeah. Mm, that's good chocolate. Don't let the powder trick us, right? This one feels a lot better to me. That's quality chocolate, I don't know. Am I right? Okay. Don't let the powder trick you guys. They tried to dress up a pig. But the chocolate in that, the taste of that chocolate is wow. It's really incredible. You guys should go buy those mochi. I mean, I haven't had chocolate like that since like Zuma, where they have a cake that explodes with like the best quality chocolate. Damn, you're gonna keep going till I'm wrong. Is it? I'm scared it's gonna be the one. Shit. Sorry, poop. All right, so what is this, guys? This looks very basic, so I don't know if the expensive would be so basic. This might be better quality because, you know, you don't have to like make it look like an orange to like dress it up and fake it. You know what I mean? Like they have to do that because it's probably like fake and sh excuse me, and, and, and not as good. These people are like, our sh so our, <clears throat> our chocolate is so good that we don't even need to put them in a thing to tell you, remind you that it's an orange. That's how good it is. Let's try. Okay, I'll right, cool. yeah. Oh, this is amazing. I'm hoping this is the more expensive one. No! But I gotta tell you, there's no orange in here. It's just chocolate, it's a trick. You tricked me. I got tricked, guys. There's no orange in here, it's just chocolate. I don't get it, but I'm telling you, this sucks. This one is so much better. Jill, can you try? Will you try a piece of chocolate? Try this, it's chocolate with an orange in it. It's incredible, I think they made a mistake. Mm, is this the fake one or the good one? No, that's the cheap one. Now try. This is amazing. That's what I'm saying. Now try the expensive one. Candy. They tried to trick me. They waited till the last one. Mm, there's no orange in here. That's what I'm saying. It's a trick, guys. I got tricked. Bring me the yeah. olives. Because I didn't eat the olives. I, this was a trick. Give yeah. me those. I don't even eat trick. olives. I got tricked on this one. Just leave this mess. I hate green olives, but I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. Wow. Ooh. These have no flavor, so if they're more expensive, that's terrible for you to buy them. These are amazing. I'm just gonna say these. I know it's gonna be, is it these? Okay, thank God. Because I was like, these are so gross. I thought it was a trick, because they're shiny, you wanna pick them, because they're more expensive. But they actually are delicious, and I hate olives, like green olives, I like black olives. How was I compared to everybody else? So am I really the food god uh, to you guys at Cosmo? Am I the food god? Thank you, I just wanted to make sure because I feel like it really takes the, like, the knowledge of seeing all that textures and flavors and smells of like putting that together. So except the one trick that I had. I feel like one was just a slice of chocolate. That's it guys, it's the food god. I don't know what else to say. I think I did pretty damn good. Guys, thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe to Cosmo. See you soon.